you have multiple sheets in a workbook, and we want to link those sheets. Data is not always on one sheet nice and neat. No, the world is not that simple, folks. So we have things on multiple sheets. And here, I'm going to show you about making a summary sheet that's linked to two other sheets, and it's integrated and accurate and easy. Let's look. Here we go. On the Tuesday sheet, we have the people who attended and the fee that they're paid. Thursday, same thing, more people and their fees. We don't want to combine all of this on one sheet. That's why we're going to make a summary sheet and we go back to what's called summary. We want the total fees from Tuesday. We're going to do equals sum, open parentheses. While the parentheses is open, go to the Tuesday tab, highlight the range of fees, enter. It bounces back to the summary sheet and we see $4,175. Now we need to do the same for Thursday. Equals sum, open parentheses. Go to the Thursday tab, highlight the fees, enter $4,150. Now we need a count of who attended each day. Equals count A. What count A does for us is it counts every non-blank cell in the highlighted range. So we're gonna go to Tuesday, highlight the names, enter 13 people. Thursday equals count A, open parentheses, Thursday, highlight the names, enter 13 people on Thursday. Now here's a bonus tip for you. I'm gonna do a double window so we can see what's going on. View, new window. Now I can see side by side. And when I make a change, because we realized that Benji actually did not attend. So I'm gonna highlight Benji and this fee, right click, delete. I wanna shift sales up and then watch on our summary tab. The changes are gonna happen automatically. Okay, look at that. 37.75 for fees on Tuesday and only 12 people attended on Tuesday. That's what we get by linking these worksheets. We keep everything tight and accurate. And when we make a change, it happens everywhere that's relevant. <laughs>